Oh, I'm about to swing up about it. All right, Bert. Um, hey, hey, what's going on, my little talkers? King Market is in here today. We're going to be talking about something interesting. We're going to be talking about um, character creation and jump force. Now, a lot of people have been talking about this. That's, the, that's just pretty much been the talk of the town pretty much um, for the past few hours. So I kind of want to you know, give my two, cent, two cents in on stuff on, on, on something like that. Now, when we react to the, to, to the jump force, to jump for, damn, what's wrong with me today? I'm talking too fast. But what's, when we react to the jump force trailer, we saw a character creation. I thought it was Ace, but no. It may actually be a created character. It may actually be a created character for Jump Force, like I said before, if they put character creation in this game, that's going to be something crazy. You know, adding adding character creation to this type of game, to this kind of playstyle of a game, that's something that's something to talk about. That's something to be a hype over. Now, to the, like that's actually really cool. I'm if they actually do pull, if they, they actually do something like this, that's just going to throw Shinobi Striker and all the games I just mentioned out of the water. Yes, you may disagree with me. I may get some hate on that. But it's true. I mean, Jump Force is just leading the anime gaming category right now. You know, this is all people are talking about. People are talking about this the more than, you know, like a one Justice or Shinobi. I mean, eh, I put Shinobi Striker maybe a second. But the rest of those, those games we saw, now, don't forget, now, Killer Kill, Kill, let's not forget about Killer Kill. Now, I totally forgot about Killer Kill. That was actually the last game I meant to say, but I thought about that. Now, Killer Kill is actually, I, mean, I am looking forward to because I love Killer Kill. Killer Kill is one of my favorite animes of all time. And one of the best, you know, you know it, not not a great story. I mean, it's, not, it's a great story, but it's not like you know amazing. But it's um, I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to the Killer Kill game. So let's not count that out. I'm not ready to count that out. But I'm already counting out One's Justice. Even though One's Justice does shine in some aspects, I'm not really too hyped for that. Uh, Black. Oh, we can throw Black Clover in there. E irrelevant track. I don't care. I don't care if anybody says. I don't care. What no one says. Y'all can say that game looks good or whatever. That game looks garbage to me. I would never pay sixty something dollars, sixty five dollars for that game. Game looks terrible. Black Clover. Here's the games we can just forget about. Black Clover, Shinobi Striker, One is Justice, and uh, what was the last? And uh, what was and Tokyo Ghoul Caught Exit. I'm not. I don't care about that. Where should we? We're focusing on World Seeker and Jump Force. Those are the two games we need to be focusing on. Now, if you guys like those four games, uh, listen, I'm not judging. That those aren't the games for me. I love those anime. I love Killer. All right, hold on, my fault. I love. I don't really love Black Clover, but I do like it. I do like. Uh, uh, what? Else? Damn, I do. I, I do love my. We all know how much I love Naruto. I love my academia. We all know that. If you guys, you guys go watch my reactions. So much I love my academia. You guys know I love. Tokyo Ghoul, you guys. Well, I only have too many. I have like two reactions up on Tokyo Ghoul. But anyway, I, but I love Tokyo Ghoul. I'm a huge fan of Tokyo Ghoul. I love the anime and I'm enjoying the manga. The manga is actually really great. Um, oh, how do we forget about the Gintama game? The, the, when's that game even coming out? The Gintama game that's supposed to come out? When is that game coming out? <laughs> that Dynasty Warriors Gintama game? When is that coming out? But, uh,. Yeah, I was looking forward. I'm looking forward to that. I don't know when they maybe it's coming out sometime this year or next year. I don't know. But anyway, go back to the character creation. Now, this if Jump Force has character creation, that's going to just just blow all the games I just mentioned out of the water. If they add character creation, if they put character creation in this game, that's going to be amazing. And keep in mind, this game's gonna have a story mode as well. So we expect that's some great stuff right there. That's something to we that's something to look forward to, and that's something that's going to be freaking awesome. If they add character creation in this game, I cannot wait. Hopefully, it is character creation in this game. Hopefully, it's something else. Customization. Oh my gosh, customization is supers. Uh, clothing. Oh my gosh, bro. It's just 2019 is going to be something to look forward to. You know this. Yeah, 2019 is going to be a year to look forward to. It's going to be the year of anime games for just gaming in general. Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to hook this put. I can't. I'm going to have to get a new hard drive for this for this, for this baby right here. You know what I'm saying? It's time for a new hard drive because there's so much heat that's coming out next year, bro. I can't wait till 2018 is over. But, yeah, character creation and Jump Force, go for it, bro. Go Make this game the best anime game. Uh, make this game the best anime game of all time. Man. I can't wait. But like I said, if they do add character creation in this game, that's something that's actually going to be really, really cool. That's something to look forward to. Like I said, I thought that looked like Ace because for one, he had the straw hat. 
and his hair looks somewhat long and the fact that they're kind of taking a realistic look to this game you have i thought that was ace since they're trying to take a realistic look to the to, the, uh, to jump force i low-key thought that was ace and i know i cannot be the only person that thought that <laughs> i know i cannot be the only one but that thought that but um yeah i thought that was ace for a minute but if you look closely he doesn't even have the tattoos on his freaking arm so but if that's what i think it is Yeah, buddy. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, that's something that's going to be awesome, man. But, um... Yeah. But, yeah. Uh, like I said, I'll, I'm looking forward to Jump Force. More, I'm looking forward to... That. Jump Force is one of the games I'm looking Like, one of the games I'm looking forward to the most of 2019. I'm looking forward to that game a lot, actually. I'm looking forward to that game more than freaking One Piece World Seeker. And I'm hyped for that game. Uh, kill a kill. I'm looking forward to that game more than kill a kill. I'm looking forward to Jump Force more than any. This game has, this game is what J, J Star's victory plus whatever should have been. That's what J like, bro. The gameplay looks really good. Some characters look kind of clunky, but for the most part, for the most part, the gameplay looks buttery smooth. I love the way the game looks. Simple. So, I don't know, man. I don't know what you want me to say, but that's it, man. That's all I really wanted to say. There, there's my thoughts on the character, on the potentially of having the character creation. I know not to, not to. Gee, I was kind of talking about it, so I want to talk about it myself because I really hope this is what I think it is. I really want it to be a character creation game. If it, if it does get this game, is going to be a classic. That's that, and that's facts. This is your boy King Mark Entertainment. I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay safe, stay fresh, and uh, yeah. Bye, Zeke. Like, comment, subscribe if you are new to the channel. And uh, yeah, man. Whew. Category Creation Jump Force. Lit. That's awesome.